Active shooter events can happen anywhere at any time. Your school is no exception. Active shooter events are scary, but unfortunately, you need to be prepared for the worst. Preparation and forethought will help you react in a better way. Your survival and the survival of others can depend on whether you have a plan, are familiar with it, and have the right tools at your disposal. Your school has an emergency response plan that provides directions for lockdowns and emergency situations. Be familiar with it and also use common sense. The Department of Homeland Security recommends run, hide, fight. In an active shooter event, if you can, run. Remove yourself from the situation, help others evacuate. If you cannot run, hide. Your school has protocols for emergency lockdowns. Lock your door, cover windows, keep your students calm, quiet, and out of the line of sight. If there is no other option, fight for your life. The emergency response shield is a tool to do so. Your school is equipped with Hardwire's emergency response shields. The shield is a piece of armor designed to stop bullets from assault rifles, shotguns, handguns, blades, and blunt force weapons. Warning, the following footage contains live gunfire of the emergency response shield being test shot. The shields are spaced throughout your school so that in any public area or hallway, you can see and have access to a device. They are red in color and are most commonly placed with or near a fire extinguisher. The emergency response shield is similar to a fire extinguisher. Think of it as a tool intended to buy you time and offer protection until first responders arrive. How to use the ERS. Directions for use, grab, Position, protect, disable. The following clip is a full speed simulation. Okay, let's break this down. First, grab the shield. The shield weighs 25 pounds. Brace yourself as you grab the outermost handles. Step two, position yourself with the shield. Hold the shield with two hands. Get into a comfortable athletic stance. Bend your knees slightly, get into a position where you could move quickly if needed. Hold the shield in front of your torso, protecting your vital organs. Step three, protect yourself and others. If you are holding the shield, get students and staff to stand behind you. If you are confronted with the shooter and have no other option but to fight for your life, disable the shooter. Rush the shooter and ram into them with the shield. Aim for the gun. Strike hard and fast. Act with aggression. Remember, you are fighting for your life and the life of others. If you are a school resource officer or first responder, this shield can be used tactically with your gun. Grab the shield with one hand and execute your response protocols. In summary, be aware and be prepared. Know your surroundings your school's emergency response plan, and the tools that are available to you. If you are confronted with an active shooter, use your emergency response shield to grab, position, protect, and disable.